Hi guys, just a quickie today. I'm only opening the advent calendars. Um, I have a lot on today and what has made it worse is that Milo has been sent home from school um, with COVID symptoms. And of course that means Levi has to come home as well. So we now have the three kids rampaging as well as all the jobs that we have to do. So, <laughs> so all of a sudden we don't have much time. Um, he doesn't have COVID. We know he doesn't have COVID. He's got an ordinary child's bit of a sniffle at Christmas. Um, but of course they have to take it. it I don't want anyone to think that I'm saying that he shouldn't be home. It seems really silly to me because it is just a cold. But if you are someone who's got a child um, who is susceptible to illnesses, I can understand. So please don't give me a hard time. I understand why they do it. Um, it's just kind of, oh no, especially when we know this is just a sniffle that we've all had and it's been running around and around amongst us. Anyway. I'm a minute in and I haven't opened an advent yet. So here we go. And I'm starting Charlotte Tilbury as well today. I'll come to that in a minute. Let's get Max, sorry. <laughs> so today's the 13th, unlucky for Sam. Here we go. It's a nice big box from Mac this time. Um, let's see, all wrapped up. And it, oh, it's another clear something. Oh, lip glass. So it's lip gloss, I presume. Yeah, glossy, brilliant lip gloss. I probably won't use that. I'm not much of one for lip glosses. Um, I've got a bit of a kind of a, uh, how would I put it? I move my mouth in a funny way sometimes. And if I use things like lip gloss, I tend to get it on my teeth and stuff. <laughs> I've got one of those very mobile faces, people. So that'll go in my giveaway. Um, I don't mind, I think that's the first one of, of um, Mac that I was sort of like, meh. But that's fine. Um, I mean, they can't do... Is it 24? I think it's 24. They can't possibly do 24 things. Look, I'm talking and looking away. Yes, it is 24. Um, they can't possibly get it right 24 times, can they? And, you know, for some people, that would be a great present. Um, then moving into Space NK. Uh, 13, there it is. Ugh went out and did the horses this morning and then had to come in and have a shower and sort of pull myself together a little bit oh i'm tired i am going to take you to see the horses i might try and do some filming of them this afternoon when we're working with them um i was just thinking to myself as, as i was doing it and i put them out they look like rspca cases that's what they look like because they're wandering along they're really very fed up with this weather they're so like us it does make me laugh we let them out of the stables they're all excited to come out the stables and then they sort of go oh so it's still gray it was still wet and muddy oh really you know <laughs> it does make me laugh but i'm going to try and get some footage today oh this is a nice one this is a cordelie Oh, a de beauty. It's a beauty elixir. Smoothing, glowing complexion. I love these liquid things. I'm hoping this is a spray it on your face and, and forget about it job. Uh, what does it say? Shake before use. Close your eyes and mist onto the face before applying your moisturiser and, and at any time of the day. No parabens or phenoxyethanol. 100% uh, natural fragrance. You know, I love things that you spray on your face. So I'm, I'm going to go for it. Let me just get it going. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, it smells like... Um, it's got a very menthol-y smell. Oh, it really has. A very menthol-y smell. That's not my favourite, I have to say. I think they're probably using that kind of thing to help it dry, but yeah it's a bit like a cold care remedy guys honestly that really reminds me of you know when you've got a bit of vix on you or a bit of Ooh, i'm not keen i mean maybe it'll do amazing things but i'm not keen <laughs> i went from excited to not keen just like that spoiled see oh it does though Honestly, as I'm moving around now, it is just like, I'm wasting, when I go through there, I'm going to see if um, either mum or, or Jay says, 
you put Vicks on mum because that's what it smells like it's very so balsamy anyway sorry uh so on to the um selfridges one i think it's the smallest drawer oh and it's an hourglass ambient lighting powder directions apply finishing powder over the face using the hourglass ambient lighting oh so it's like um oh, you know like a setting powder but they've called it ambient oh it's very snazzy the the, the packaging very snazzy um oh and opens beautiful oh look so that's the color that's in there just going to swatch oh it feels lovely on my finger so it comes out it's like that oh i can see and it'll sort of give you a glow from within it's got um well it's not glitter but like a like a sheen in it so i'm really excited to try that i'm really really pleased with that one you know what they say about the best things coming in small packages okay and then we're on to charlotte tilbury now you guys have helped me out so much you know my channel's called form figures it out because i'm always trying to figure something out whether i look good in something or something works or something i'm always trying to figure something out and you guys have helped me because i was never really aware of when the 12 days of christmas are you hear people talking about it i've always presumed that it started a bit before christmas <laughs> as it turns out it's christmas day to the 6th of january I now know that and I'm really pleased. I'm so glad you guys said, no fawn, you dope, this is what it is. Um, my nana would be like, at your age, not knowing that at your age. Anyway, I now know. But so that I can show it to everybody, because um, I wouldn't want to come on on Christmas Day. And, so, and I mean, you wouldn't want to watch me on Christmas Day. I'm going to start it now and run it so that it finishes with all the other calendars. And then I know I haven't, you know, let anyone down. So let me get it it's a beautiful calendar i mean it looks like a chest of drawers done in this sort of glittery um paper and then all the knobs are little silver stars i'm gonna have to figure out a way to use those you know afterwards because i it, they're too good to just throw in the rubbish so let's have a look where is number one now i've just noticed it doesn't seem to have numbers on the drawers ah oh. You lift up the top, look at that, I didn't know that. You lift up the top, it's like a beauty box, look. And you go, woo. Uh, may all your beauty dreams come true. But as I say, there are no numbers on the drawers. So I'm guessing you just start at the top and work your way to the bottom. So um, this is number one. Well, <laughs> this is the first one and I shall go for it. So you pull it, oh, it's a long drawer, look at that. And look at that that's i mean there's real oh and they're properly screwed i mean you're not really interested in this but i'm going to show you can you see they've actually used a little screw so this could these could be taken off and screwed onto other things so i really like that simple things simple minds i'm full of little sayings this morning so first out is multi miracle glow it's cleanser mask and balm for baby soft glowing skin a cleanser a mask and a balm let me see what it says massage in using my wonder workout technique i don't know that i'll have to look it up on youtube wash off for fresh glowing skin to use as a mask leave it on for 10 minutes or overnight for best results well i'm going to be trying all of the well i'm <laughs> I think I'll probably try it. It doesn't have a cap on it. Doesn't really smell of anything. I think, because I, I associate her stuff with being a bit perfumed, but I can't smell anything for that balsam smell, for that um, Vicks smell. Let me just try. No, it, I don't think, if it has a scent, it's soft and gentle and is being swallowed whole by the Vicks smell so there we go a multi miracle glow mask cleanser or balm 
I don't know that might actually go in a giveaway actually <laughs> I was gonna say I'm not going to I did start to say that didn't I I'm not gonna give away the Charlotte Tilbury's but I've got loads of things like that not Charlotte Tilbury admittedly but I've got loads of things like that and I just it's such a little thing but I did squeeze a bit out onto my hand didn't I so can I give it away but it didn't have a cap on it oh so that was number one of the Charlotte Tilbury box which I just like I say I think the box alone is really really beautiful so I'm off that was it just as I say a quickie um lots and lots to catch up on and lots and lots to do so I hope you're all doing well um oh, I bet you're like me <laughs> just frazzled right now with all the things we've got to get done um, and having the kids added in is it's it's fun <laughs> but it does mean that everything takes twice as long they come down to the horses with us and you know oh, they want to use a wheelbarrow they've got their own little wheelbarrows they've got their own little um forks and brushes and spades and all of that sort of thing and they do but they're just more in the way than anything else but you don't want to put them off because well one day they'll be blinking useful <laughs> Anyway, that's me. I'm off. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye, guys.